A launch vehicle or carrier rocket is a rocket used to carry a payload away from Earth's surface. Launch vehicles typically have two or more stages. The principle behind this is Newton's third law. That is action and reaction which push rockets forward simply by expelling their exhaust in the opposite direction at high speeds. A rocket is initially powered by rocket boosters. It contains two tanks, one with fuel and other with oxygen as reactants. A combustion chamber in which fuel is injected and combustion takes place. The product is gas with high enthalpy is passed through a nozzle, where it gains high kinetic energy. This gas generates thrust for propelling a rocket. For launching a payload, mass plays a crucial role. More the mass, more the fuel required, which also means more fuel to carry that extra fuel. Thus a multi-stage rocket system is used, which does a job of releasing the fuel tank once the fuel is used. At liftoff the first stage is responsible for accelerating the vehicle. The first stage then burns to completion and falls off. At second stage, only the payload mass which may be a satellite, is present making it easy for positioning in an orbit. This reduces the cost involved in reaching orbital velocity since large mass is cut down during second stage. At the time of launch, after ignition, forces due to air drag and gravity of entire system will be higher than thrust generated by combustion of fuel. After initial combustion, which increases exponentially, the thrust force exceeds the opposing forces, causing a lift. For launching a suborbital payload, the rocket should attain a speed of 7,800 meter per second. A speed of 9,300 meter per second is required for an orbital launch. An Earth escape velocity of 11,000 meter per second is required for the payload to overcome Earth's gravitation pull and launch toward a translunar or interplanetary flight.